Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. This government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Ow. Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Be 
in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can see. Church. I confess my sins. What are we doing here? I'm here to kill you all. Just saying. Everything's fine, that survived the apocalypse. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much up here. They'll respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a Yeah, you too. It ain't here. Hello again, Justin. You don't want to miss out on your finales. What show are you watching? There will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us. Take our guns. Take our freedom. Take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, sure, come on. Hold on. We will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff. Sure, there not. will be no more back. suffering. Oh, oh, fuck it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we built. Do not touch that service. Hold on and don't stand down. Stand down. Everyone calm down. We knew this moment would come. We've prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold. See, people, <clears throat> people didn't understand me when I when I explained why I keep my keep my distance from that woman, or why I stay behind cover because her arrow, her arrows can kill you very quickly. I I had six health bars, and on a couple of those occasions she hit me once or twice, and my health is nearly completely gone. So she yeah, she's dangerous. If you stay out in the open where she can see you, she will fuck you up. I promise. Stay on the path, I've died many times to her in the past, that's how I learned. I am a federal marshal. I'm ordering you to 
stand back. <clears throat> That's all. ULL. Why don't you just finish the game off as well, dude? Assuming you haven't done it already. I don't think you have, but I could be wrong. God and I need to have a discussion then, don't we? Dispatch. Oh my god. Everything is just fine here. I don't need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. Geez, sure would come in handy here.
<laughs> I tried to climb through that window like I was playing Resident Evil. Play ball, that's a football stadium. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ, Rook. I'm sorry, I thought they got you. Come on, come on. Jesus, I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, we've gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh. <laughs> you think? Well, who, who does want to be here by a metal pipe? I mean, the last time I was injured by metal is because I trapped my hand in between two cages at work. And that was a heavy impact, and I had a bruise on my hand for three weeks. And it was not fun.
you tell me they have fucking air support? Jesus Christ, I nearly got us there. States unconscious Martian now, buddy. You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. Fuck. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can 
unfuck this situation. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it. I get it. I got friends that have been taken, too. The problem is... There ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you John! What the hell? Are you doing chump? Be careful out there. <laughs> I it's have a gun. With Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. He me, me, miney, mother. Catch all the tigers by their twos. <laughs> Ding. You should talk to your plumber about the pipes. Ah, Montana. Now listen up. There's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people. We might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy even yeah, property I'm okay. that's all over the place now. Just about. Hell, my mom, my mom's not okay though. Third, the thing was that... <laughs> The problem with this country right now is the weather. The weather is rain, sun, rain, sun. Like it's throughout the day that is. It's just rain then sun, rain then sun. But uh, the the rain always makes the pain worse. So my mum <coughs> has been struggling a bit with that. I mean, we were sitting in there watching Terminator 3 earlier on, and she just said to me like, I, "Is everything in your body aching?" I says, "Not quite everything yet." I says, like, is it, do you think it's going to rain again? And she said, yeah. I looked out the window and you can see the, the clouds on the horizon. <laughs> My mum can always tell when the bad weather's coming because it, it triggers her pain off. Which makes sense, because it happens to everyone that's a uh, pain sufferer. And surprise, surprise, I went back to bed for a couple of hours. But anyway, far cry time. Been playing a bit of Resident Evil in between. Uh, I'm trying to upgrade the rest of the weapons 
see what they're like. And um, that little handgun that looks like the scorpion. When you fully upgrade that thing, it's a monster. <clears throat> it's like a it's like a rapid fire. I don't even know what to describe it as. It's still a handgun, but it's it's almost like a machine gun sort of thing. It's got it's even got like a <clears throat> a drum magazine that you can put on it. It's uh, it's a weapon that's worth using. Let's put it that way. The damage is pretty high for it. But I want to. <clears throat> I want to see if I can get some more weapons as well and upgrade them. Mind you, it won't be easy because I still got lots of points I need to acquire first. But I still need to complete on the toughest difficulty too, which I'll probably do soon. I'll definitely stream it, mind you. Oh, and according to Ashley, all right, no, no, I didn't know about this, so nobody else mentioned it to me either. But Ashley, Ashley pointed out to me that Avengers, the game that is, uh, received a number of updates lately. And one of the, in during one of those updates, they fixed the fucking game so that you could replay the campaign now. And that includes replaying it with the stuff that you unlocked for all of the characters on the, the playthrough itself or anything you locked in the grinding. And the game plays a lot smoother now than it did before. So I was actually kind of happy to hear that. Um, I did play the first half hour of the game as Kamala. And... Sure enough, you can just put you can put your equipment back on that you've unlocked. That's fucking great. That's exactly what should have happened right from the beginning. I mean, what kind of game doesn't have a, a replayable campaign? What the fuck, man? So I'm glad they've done that at least. I may I may just look into it again. Cause I haven't even played as Kate Bishop or Hawkeye yet, and they've got their own replayable stories, you know. But at least it's a step in the right direction. Where's where's the dude over there? He never goes over there. Oh, come on. Okay, I've never once seen this guy walk over to this spot. Never once. Did they change the game without telling me about it? I guess this is what the project needs. Yeah, the project needs you dead. Just like I do. Bada bum bum ba 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 bum.
help me. I was a dead man. Thanks. Hey, this could be fun. Hey, deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the day you should head to the forest research station. Ghost's been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. <clears throat> yeah, maybe, maybe not. To a lot of people, the game would be dead. Me, I was wa I was waiting for the campaign to be replayable at the very least, and everything else to be replayable, and they've done that much. And for the record, there's a lot of people on my friends list right now that are actually playing the game again. I mean, there are still those out there that are not interested. That's fair enough. But a number of people have come back to it. May not necessarily save it, but at least they're still going to go through with it. Just depends on what you do, really. I mean, I wouldn't say that the game is bad. I, ne I never actually thought it was bad. I thought it was pretty good. It was just some of the gameplay aspects that were pretty much fucked up. them up. Good idea. Good. Good job clearing out the research station. Peggy's won't be back after the ass whooping you just laid on him. While you're there, check around and see if any folks are left alive. Lady, you're an angel. Thank you. Shit, kid. I'm impressed. I'm not so fucking an angel. Don't thought. call me an angel. You got a this shot game anyway. up this resistance. Next step is clearing up the radio signal. My CB's on the fritz. I can't get a hold of anyone off this island. The radio tower near the south shore must be busted. You think you can take care of that for me? It's busted. What do you call him busted? Busted.
Hmm. I don't necessarily disagree with that. It's, um, it does have an interesting tutorial. It's got a pretty good intro as well, despite despite my problems with the game I itself. Know what you'll do with those. I mean the I mean the intro for this one was quite chaotic. It was it was crazy. So I mean you know they they got a few things right. Still trying to find the positive over the negative, which I always prefer anyway. Sure do miss hunting here. Sure. I mean, why not? Take what the dead don't need. to climb towers all over the county. That's alright. I'll survive. Fucking hell, man. You're like, what, 24 or 23 and your nephew's 17? <laughs> wow. Not bad. Spiritual mingler speaking. I need help. Hello? This is Ms. Mabel. Hello? The cult riled up little peaches, and now those cunts are gonna get their dick scratched off. <laughs> those cunts are gonna get their dick scratched off. <laughs> <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
me being the dope, I didn't think this one through before I started playing. <coughs> what do we have? Uh, drop in marina, peaches, taxidermy. centers every one of us you me <laughs> even the father knows deeply of sin it's a poison that clouds our minds what if I told you you could be free from sin what if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true what if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea Freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed, you will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Sorry, just wanted to get a drink and I didn't even say be right back. How rude. That's alright, I'm not perfect, I know. <laughs> Falls End. I'm gonna fall off this this tower for that vertigo. Come on, stupid ice thing. You won't last long. Even if you pour. <laughs> Been having a right laugh at work with Ashley. Every time we go to curse something, we just call it a thing now. A stupid thing. It's a stupid paper thing. Stupid chip thing. Stupid light thing. Stupid chocolate thing, every freaking thing you can think of. <laughs> it's been funny. 
Thanks, the Lady Dimitrescu and the things. Is there any goats? No goats. Dear. I'm not thinking of goats, oh yeah, because I saw like a million goats earlier on today. I got goats on the brain. My go to goats. Quack, 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 quack. Driving me quackers. Barrel roll. Break. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Name of the deputy's law. Inbound. Get your butt over here, son. Okay, let's go. Oh, there you are. Yeah, I'll tell you what, man. It is shocking to see how quickly some people grow up. Um, for example, um, one of the one of the ladies I, I used to know in my old store. Um, well, I always had a crush on her. Uh, she knew that as well. Um, the fuck? She's got two. She's got two boys now. Right. The last time I saw her son. He was six years old, and she was she was queuing up in my store the other day. I didn't realise it was her because she had a mask on and she had two boys with her. And um, she came over and I just clicked that it was her and she <laughs> she's like, "Why? You didn't notice me, like, did you?" I'm like, "No, I didn't realise that was you." And um, I looked at the her son. I swear there's a book here somewhere. I said, no way. I said, is is that Reese? Like and she, she said, yeah. And I was like, oh my god, I'm looking him in the eye now. Last time I saw him, he was just like, freaking three or four feet tall. Which when I know, he's, he's like, what, nearly 14 now? Who the fuck are you? I swear there's a book here. Or am, I, am I on the wrong island? I think I'm on the wrong one, you know. A minute. But I mean, I look. But I mean, he didn't know who I was, so he didn't remember me anyway. And I, I would have been surprised if he did. But I, I was stunned. I could not believe how. I mean, she, she saw how stunned I was. I was absolutely gobsmacked. So like, wow, wow. That that boy, my God. I'm 14 years old. Didn't look him in the eye. You take the wheel. Jesus. I mean, I wish I had a chance to talk to her for longer, but I was busy at the time anyway, but it was, ni it was nice to see her again after all this time. I mean, she knew I worked in that store, and she w she works in my old store now. My freaking god, do they grow up so quick! I'm like, where the hell did that did all those years go? Man, I'm not even a parent. But, I mean, bloody hell, man. That that was one of the biggest shockers I'd had that had in the week. I can tell you that. It was sure wow. <laughs> it's very frightening. I mean, and just within one year, because so many of the kids weren't coming into the store anyway, so many of them they they gotten so tall. Some of them have sprouted up by a few inches, and that was only in one year. I found that shocking enough. But now that they've all started reappearing because everything is quieting down over here, you know, it's, um, it's understandable, I guess. Some of them I didn't even recognize, so I had to double check that I was who I was looking at. Only message I did get was from my niece, Jess. 
she said the cult had turned the lumber mill into a prison camp. Maybe you can start there. Uh-oh. That just happened. Hey. What was that? Oh, skull fuck. Oh, skull fuck. <clears throat> yep, skull fuck. Rescue this poor fuck here. Please, thanks for setting me free, Deputy. You're welcome. Of course, I'm speaking for the deputy. Be my deputy. White tails got to stick together. And you ain't no white tail. Oh, that's nice. I can't believe what just happened. Huh. I'm on the move. Watch it, I'll get you. There you are. Fuck, I can't see. Yeah, sniping you, my pistol. Twit. <sighs> I try to be smart. I try. Just makes me dumber. I think somebody lost their plane. Have me killed. Have me killed. You see that? Well, that's what I need. Just didn't see it. Thanks, Mr. Tanner. Dead. Human sized fish. Money, money. We just gotta put trust in each other, that's all. We'll get our freedom back. Got in my sights! Killed one! Damn, I just gotta rush. <coughs> Better you than me! Congratulations! 
factory. Give me that. Just a few bumps and bruises this time. I missed the part where that's my problem. about this Far Cry game, I spent more time in the water on this one than I do in any of the others. And this because, well, I guess it's because navigating the water is quite fun in this one. Plenty of water too. Hey, where the hell am I? This way. I know where we are. Let's offload here. Nah, I got it from the boyfriend. The husband doesn't like me right now. Because I'm going nowhere. Bison! 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 See? I knew he was going to say that. <laughs> Yay! Bison! Bison! Get off my screen. Oh yeah, how much do I need for another weapon? Holster. Eight. Right, uh, shouldn't, shouldn't be too difficult. <clears throat> I need another gun, Sen. Mr. Gunson. I need a gun. This is a gun. Give it to me now. What the hell? Come on. Come on. Want forgiveness? Get religion. Could I get? <sighs> oh. Peggy. So you're okay in my book. What's that? Oh, look at that little Wolverine. Got him. I see a Peggy over there. My, what big claws you have!
Why not? Stay hungry! We got this! Let's give them hell! What is that that just took him out? Oh, it's a muscle, it's a bit of his. What do you mean by interaction with Anton's soldiers? Do you mean actually talking to them? Or do you mean just comments that they make in general? Because, I mean, <laughs> comments in general they definitely will have, we know that. Oh shit! Kill that guy! Kill him! You fucking asshole! Fuck you, man. Nice shot. Wanna play rap? Bye soon! Did we win? I'm going! Cover me! Found you! <laughs> oh, come on! Ah, oh, come on! Oh, sorry, overreaction. Well, overreaction or reaction. Of course. Um, I mean, what recent Far Cry game doesn't have that? I mean, uh, logically, if you find one of your colleagues just dead on the floor, you're, you're, gonna, you're gonna react to it, aren't you? <laughs> These clowns definitely will. Pro probably with Cuban accents, yeah. Hey, come here. Come here, you little shit. Gotcha. There we are, three wolverines, that should cover it. And you, cut it out! Stop! What the fudge is that? Oh, it's a it's a bear. It's a nice big bear. Screw it! I'm going in. Yeah, yeah. Give it! Give it! Give it!
Fuck about the company. Just fucking there. Take that. Bum 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 bum. You no, know, I'm gonna start with the AK this time. <clears throat> I don't usually start with this weapon, but uh, I will start with it. All right. There's nothing clean about that. I killed that poor woman. I need to count my lucky stars. Let's count my lucky stars. Settle down now. Don't tell me to settle down. Who set this up? Me. That's who. I think we can agree this is a good farming spot. And bison skins are worth a fair bit. Who keeps... why do they... hey, is that you? Are you tagging them? That's why. And he revives himself when he's down. Not bad. It's a good ability. Bison! 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 A piss on! Cover me! Gonna move! See, he can kill them. <laughs> Someone's watching over me. Someone to watch over me. Nicely done. Peggy went flying, man. That was funny. Good idea. Could have something to do. Cover me! Gonna move! 
Oh, what a hit. Mm hmm. Finders keepers. Well, that's assuming they introduce something like a Chosen. I mean, the Chosen, they don't appear as often as, um, as they should, ideally. But, you know, you know, I mean, it's Far Cry always operates the same way. I mean, it depends on what region you're in, or what level of the game you're at. They always add more powerful enemies. So, I would expect to see something like that. Like, more powerful soldiers. Not necessarily a dick in a plane, but I wouldn't put that past them either because um, we know planes are in the game. But the, the, the feeling I'm getting with this this Far Cry is that um, I think they're going to introduce aspects from all of the Far Cry games into this one. That that's the feeling that I get. It's going it's going to be a, an infusion of by almost everything they do with Far Cry. Oh, that was mean. That was very mean. So, I mean, like, you got, um, for example, we've seen the horses, or horse. So that means that horse riding is going to be a thing, right? Now, when you think about the horse riding aspect, where, where was that included? while well, riding on the back of an animal. It was um, primarily Far Cry Primal. They first introduced it in Far Cry 4 when you can ride on the back of an elephant, which is cool. But they really, they really put it into full gear with Far Cry Primal, riding on the back of a saber to tiger or a bear. That was really cool. So horse riding is logical. And you got planes, right? We don't know what they're gonna do with those planes, but I, I have ideas. I've got ideas, yeah, um, they could, they, they could send a, f a whole fucking fleet of planes or something after you, you know, you never know. Can you imagine that? You're gonna wish you are in a bloody tank. And of course there's the tanks too. Don't forget the tanks. So they're introducing new stuff, but they're, they seem to be bringing back everything that was in the previous games. That's what it looks like to me anyway. But, but you know what, I'm, a, I'm actually cool with that. I wouldn't mind playing a Far Cry game that's got everything we've seen before and new stuff. I'm trying to get that eagle. I would, I would, I would not oppose that at all. I would not oppose it. I'm, I'm happy with that. I can, I can go with it. Oh, it's a fucking turkey! Good God! Oh no! Sorry. God. Come on, fucking crossfire! I wanted to kill that goddamn eagle. Now I can't. Man, let's go up here. everywhere
Hey. Oh, well done. Gotta take what the dead don't need. Another chosen. What's going on here, man? Fuck off. There's <laughs> a lot of activity in this area, man. What is going on? Especially chosen. I mean, I know I'm in Jacob's region, but that was that was quite a few chosen. What's this? Is this another one? It is, isn't it? Oh yeah. <laughs> Got love a headshot. Ouch! That was right in his nose. Like literally through his nose. Ow. A little painful. For fuck's sake. All right. Let's sell this stuff. See, it's not bad farming this little area. Vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. 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 Room. Plenty of rooms to go around. <laughs> Stupid thing. I don't think I've ever driven one of those in this. That's another thing about Far Cry 6. Literally every day now, um, I even I'll send you some screenshots. Um, I'm I'm seeing quotations from what's his name Anton appearing all over the place. Quotations, you know, we haven't seen or heard of yet. Everywhere, absolutely everywhere. Far Cry 6. Far Cry 6. Far Cry 6. It's all over the place, and see that's how I know that there's something coming up soon. Right, and I'm drive. I'm willing to put money on the fact that it must be, uh, what's it called, the the Ubisoft event, on was it June 10th or June 12th, something like that. It's not it's technically around the corner. I'm convinced that's when they're going to show something. Yeah, I mean it makes sense to me. But I mean I I know from experience that when when they're about to oh shit I've got to get that. Come here. Tag it. Tag it. I want that. It's a alpha. It. Alpha. Moose. That's the same. Yeah. From experience, they they always do this before they're about to reveal something for a game. There's all this stuff that just keeps coming out, coming out, come out, doesn't stop. You know. That's just what I know. I'm up here. Give me both. Gotcha. Cute. What the fuck? Fair enough. Extra money.
This guy got moose. Chocolate moose. Another moose. I'm oh, sorry, another two moose? What's going on here? That's a lot of moose. Oh my god, no way, another alpha? Shut up! Tag it, quick. Now that is a rare sight. Extremely rare. You don't see two alphas like that. I want the alpha. I'm ready, I'm ready full of other moose skins. Let me just get the alpha. Oh, come on, man. They just disappeared. Are you serious? You fucking fuck. That was rude, man. They just disappeared. I hate it when it does that. Absolutely hate it. Ding! Oh man, if I hit him that would have been funny. Prex. Can't believe it. I don't believe it. They're all surrounding my car. Oh, what are you trying to do? The fuck? Why is there... Like... One, two, three, four, five, six of them. I'm down to chosen shit. Watch out! Making a move. Oh, the blades! Hey, 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 hey! Get out my car, woman! Get out my car! Get the fuck out! Don't take my shit. Oh. I have a repair tool. No. Let's go. Don't take my shit. Leave my shit alone. Don't find your own shit. There you go. drive through him, ever. I 
grappling hook. That was what I wanted to get. Give it. Thank you. Give. Anything I can get my hands on. What's next? What's next for me, love? Eiffel bike. Yes, please. The more ammo I get, the better. Assault rifle is a priority. Take the wheel. I'm not taking the wheel. If I take it, we won't be able to drive anywhere. Don't trust anything you see, intent. and sure as shit, don't believe a word that Faith says. Also, steer clear of those white flowers. They seem harmless, but they will fuck your shit up. If you don't believe me, just wait until you come across some of those shambling junkies. Call calls them angels, but they'll tear... I don't believe you. I said, I don't believe you. Moose. Thank you, rifle ammo will do. Because it's better than nothing, right? Ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> you like shit through a goose. You ain't a pig. Like shit through a goose. One, two, three, four, five targets up here. So what the fuck is this about? Oh! Piggies! What the hell's he? Woof, 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 woof. Woof, woof. Finders keepers. Oh no! What is it? Oh shit. It's a kit. Where are you going, kitty? Huh? Straight to the skinning. I can't believe what just happened. I don't believe it. Well, I know what's up there. That's why I came up here. So, we'll get up to the tower. What the fuck? Hey, stinky. Gotta take what the dead don't need. What? Don't look at me. They come near me. They're as good as you. Never mind Peggy's, watch out for stinkies. Shoot them all from up here. Uh oh. Woo. Oh. That wasn't supposed to happen. That was supposed to happen. Whee. I'm right behind you. 
My parachute? Come on, don't bullshit me. Move it. Get my back. Shh. Enemy spotted. Hey, watch it. Asshole. Well, thanks for all the shotgun kills, guys. That was easy. Why are they appearing in such large groups all of a sudden? What happened? Did they change this while I was while I was off? I don't normally see that many. Maybe it's just a random convergence of events. I don't know, but that's just. Yes, I know about our posts. I've liberated like 400,000 of them by now, and I still don't know the fucking layout of all of them. <laughs> That's what happens, you don't have outpost replay value, like Far Cry 4 does. I got him, I got him. Arms. I'm not 
searching anymore. I'm here to share his word. Got your back, deputy. I'm gonna need to blow off some steam in a bit. Hey, there's <coughs> Why you I've stuck got a job for any fisherman who got time. That's all killed. There you go. Hello, John. Free in the marina. Adelaide's a bit of a pistol, but she could be a big asset for us. See about lending her a hand, kid. I'm following you. That was too close. No, I let me get a sniper rifle because <coughs> I just realised what I'm about to do. It doesn't even have to be silent, just as long as I can see my targets. Thank you. Come here, hotshot. I need your help. Adelaide Drubman, pleased to make your acquaintance. Appreciate all your help getting my marina back, but honey, I got a problem. Those Peggy shipbirds stole my tulip. She's the nimblest goddamn helicopter this side of Montana, and I'll be goddamned if those fuck trumpets are gonna take her from me. I won that bird in my divorce fair and square. The walking erectile dis... Okay, okay. Don't care how you do it. But I need my chopper tulip back, and those doomsday dildos that stole are taken care of. <clears throat> I thought there was enemies in the area. Usually they interrupt the, the speech, so I have to skip it sometimes. Oh well, I guess I was wrong. Fair enough. I need to put some more ice in my drink. Be right back. <clears throat> Alright, deputies, I'm back. Right, uh... <coughs> oh, I need to get to the job bar. I actually come to think of it, one good thing about hitting face region first is you get access to a lot of vehicles.
and a lot of places where you can spawn vehicles. There's only there's one up the road that's got helicopters and and cars okay, let's go. and shit like that. As long as there's no air traffic, I should be okay. See, this here again is one of the significant differences between this and previous Far Cry games. Flying around in armed helicopters like this. And you know, people insist that it's Far Cry is always the same. Like, no, it's not. Some of, some of the smaller details are the things that they change and they can be important. Simple as. Hello, assholes! Really? Ooh. Mustard. They gave me mustard? You bastard. Hey, who's... Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks so much. No, it's not over yet. You get to live. More mustard. Thanks, you busted. Someone's watching over me. I can fix a generator, but I can't fix a cult of degenerates. Fix a generator, but can't fix cult degenerates. <laughs> That's a good one. Woo! Oh, fuck off. Oh my god. I should be shot. I should be shot! Get to the chopper. Found you. Yeah, that was actually quite funny. Um, I haven't heard any of the NPCs say that before. Have you heard that one? I, s I, s I swear, every time I, I start this game up again, I'm seeing new things in it. Every time. Oh, what's going on? I mean, I was just com I was just commenting on how many bad guys I saw on I saw on the road alone. There's a lot of bad guys. Go up to the mountain because I know there's a proper stash up there. Yeah, I mean. <clears throat> You've probably logged in as many hours on this as I have, if not more, and you haven't even heard it, dude. That's what I'm saying, there's, there's something... I feel like there's always something different with this game. I, I thought I was imagining it at first, but I'm, I'm definitely not. I mean, I couldn't believe how many, um... 
angels appeared on the road just just when you just after you'd left there was like four or five angels and they had three or four peggies with them fuck off they I mean, I got I got my shotgun challenge done ju just from killing that group alone, and then, and the ones up by the the tower. That was it. It was just done, right there and then. It was so fast. <clears throat> I don't know. I was gonna say maybe it's just a random convergence of events. I don't know. I could be completely wrong or completely right. I don't know. Some something's different. Still see that bear? Why? Okay. Okay. Let's go. Lead on. You take the wheel. Come on, descend. Can't fly very fast if you're too high in a helicopter. You always have to descend. faith twice already. I swear there's a little campsite around here somewhere that's got a magazine on it. I'm sure there is. Down here? There you are. Where? Ah, there it is. Park magazine, I'm sure. Hmm. Very bizarre. I thought there was I thought there was a park magazine down there. Hmm. Drive. Enemy down. 
You're on the move? What the fuck am I doing? Okay, let's go. Fire away, son. Honey, the minute you finish everything, bring my tulip back here. And if you see something you don't like on the ride back, feel free to fire up tulips and mounted guns. Them beauties pack more punch than a bull in heat. Are you kidding me? Those goddamn Peggy's have come back like shingles! Hope you got my tulip close, cause we need help, honey! How's it going, girl? Yeah. Hello, girlfriend. Oh. Holy shit, you did good. Well, slap my tits and call me Shirley. You made it just in time for all the fun. And you brought Tulip back in one piece. Now, I always keep my word. So, if you need a pilot who can shoot the dick off a gopher from 50 feet in the air, I'm your gal. 
You call me anytime, except around sunset. Xander likes to do yoga around then, and I like to watch. You ain't lived until you seen that ass and downward facing dog. Anyways, thanks again, hun. I owe ya. <coughs> hey, girl. You owe me. Right, <clears throat> before that wench decides she wants to have me for breakfast, let's get myself some weaponry. That can really help out. Not a pervert. She just wanted the Xander doll. Oh. when they manage to take out somebody from a chopper with a fucking pistol. I don't know how they do it, but... <clears throat> hey, game programming, logic, blah blah blah. But us, we have to do it the easier way. Which is mash buttons until we get it done right. So simple. Nope. Oh, look, Faith. A pretty little angel. I know you've heard stories about me. That I'm a liar. Her voice is so soothing with these headphones on. <laughs> and I poison people's minds. Well, let me tell you a different story. True story. There once was a young woman who had been ostracized by her community, bullied by friends, abused by her family. She took to a needle for help. She was all alone. She wanted to die. In confidence, the father showed her how special she was. She was full of love and life. He gave her a new family, one that accepted her just as she was. The young women no longer wished to die. She had been given purpose. One day, the father brought her here. He asked if she had faith in him. <clears throat> I don't see that too often. Usually bullshit, but you never know. Very much wish to live. I'm scared. The father told her this was her test. He would have faith in her if she had faith in him. So she closed her eyes and left. <laughs> the father. 
father kept his word. The path to Eden is clear to those who have faith. Walk the path. You must have faith. Let go. <clears throat> I have to admit, this scene where you first where you first see her, I think it's one of my favorites. I really like it. I will give you purpose. I will set you free. Where <laughs> am? I'm always falling out for something around here. But it's never my fault. You bastards keep drugging me. agreement in in agreement with you there man i do like it it's it's a nice it's a nice scene it just goes to show that even though your character doesn't speak you can still appreciate the characters you know which is true enough i love the way you just sort of float up through the sky with her up and up to the statue it's like whoa it's damn i haven't seen that in far cry yet I like her little, uh, her, an her angel wings. I mean, I love her, I love her voice. She's got a beautiful voice. Hello. Is anyone out of course, there? she looks stunning, but Take by the end of it, you're like, right, I want to kill this bitch. <laughs> Gotta love that. If you want, but I did it. Got a man down. I need a medic. Rook. I need more ammo. I really saved I need a man. medic. I need more ammo. They've been throwing themselves at these walls for days. Just won't let up. They already kicked open a hornet's nest. Trucks on the road. Damn it. Medic. Rook. I need jump on that wall. Cover me. I'm climbing up. I swear, when he when he was in Supernatural playing as Alistair, he was fucking scary, man. It's hard to believe it's the same guy. I'm just goes to show he's really good. Get the machine gun out. Bullets! Ooh. 
Come to me. Fuel truck, eh? Okay. Stop that truck, it's headed for the gate! I'm on the move. Actually, no, don't stop the truck. Let that arrive, because I wanna I wanna pop some angels so I can get get my machine gun close down. the way come on just want to kill a few people with rockets that's all to the music. guys get out of the way before I end up blowing this all up Mission's a good farming opportunity. Ow, 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 Don't do that ever again. Oh shit, that's not gonna work. Still here. I gotta move now. Cover. Hey, okay. Get it. Solid work, people. Celebratory packet of crisps incoming. For consumption. Rogers, there's an Arkweiler somewhere inside. Footy was using it last. Get on it. You're with me. Let's start collecting scrap. You have to pull the doors off some of the cells. Do it! Now hop to! We ain't got much time! Any problems? No. A couple of the Peggy scaled the wall, but we got them. Door. That doesn't look too bad. You'll be alright. Just keep pressure. You know, I was gonna retire last year. I was worried I'd get bored. Are you gonna introduce us, or we're just gonna stand around here all awkward and shit? Language! Oh, fuck off, Virgil. Not today. I have told you, a <laughs> vulgar mine is a sign of... You're not wearing your button! No, I'm not wearing it. <gasps> I'll need a casualty report. We're, we're cougars! We're really not. Look, I'm wearing my button. The sheriff is wearing his button. This person... I'm sorry, who He's is this? He's eating snacks. This is one of my deputies. I thought you said your deputies were taken. No, there's one who wasn't. Been giving Eden's Gate a hell of a time from what I hear. That's so. Well, I hope you plan on pitching in. No room for freeloaders. 
Oh, Tracy's all right when she gets to know you. She's right about the work, though. Plenty to be done around here. Just ask around. Couldn't have you back, bro. Okay, then. I just remember fog, and the skills then walking in a field, then I saw her. You've seen her too, haven't you, Rook? Whatever she says, whatever she promises, it's a lie. Stay away from her, you'll end up just like the Marshal. The bliss. It makes you forget. It makes you feel free. You just want to stay there forever. But it isn't real. None of it. If Virgil and Tracy hadn't found me, I'd still be out there, swimming in a sea of bliss. A prisoner in my own head. Those two saved my life. These cougars, they're good people, but they're hanging on by a thread. We gotta help them, Rook. No one else will. One last thing. We had a doctor. Well, a veterinarian, but he's doing his best. Guy went missing a couple hours ago. Don't know why, don't know how. Keep an eye out for him, would you? I should really Lots be out of people here could survive help with no me. outside help whatsoever. My wife, God rest her soul, taught me Last two days, we've had a few people go missing. Feel I've been using Only them. from what we can tell, they weren't lost in the bliss. There's been rumors of some place run by Faith's favorites. I believe what they're doing with that bliss. The kind of place nobody Someone comes back from. Torture, off. drownings. Sacrifices. People say anyone who doesn't walk Faith's little pilgrimage winds up there. They took over the water I think we got a real problem on our hands, and I need Why someone to check it out. You watch. Someone who can handle themselves if it turns out to be more than just stories. Be careful, Rook. What's up, beautiful? Wanna kiss? What the fuck? Better place if you ask me. Folks of Hope County pull off. They took over the water darling. treatment and they're poisoning everything. You And they're poisoning everything. Well, I aim to stop it, kiddo. You watch. Greetings, Virgil. You got a sec for me? We got one big job around here, <clears throat> and that's to stop Faith. She took everything from me my job, my marriage, even my son. All because of that bliss. You're one of us now, a cougar. I don't know how the fuck you stay sane after losing your, I need your job, right your now, wife, and your son. You know about fuck our water that. treatment plant? The cult took it and started pumping it full of bliss. You believe that? Right into the drinking water. What kind of monster does that? <clears throat> no, honestly, well, I think fighting longer. back I against someone straight, like that is probably the only fast. way to stay sane. What do you say? Really kind of makes sense, okay. really, doesn't it? Might be. It might just be what I would do. Might, might, might. Big might. I'm pretty impressed we managed to last this long out here. It'll be a monster of a job to get that thing. A monster job is what we need to battle faith. That girl has every peg drunk on her lies. I want to take her down enough. Don't mind me. Hey, rookie. Ready for some action? Hey. 
Sorry about before. Want some action? I'll give you some Wasn't action. Cool. Ask anyone here. I do tough really good, but the rest, well, I'm working on it. So, restart. Welcome. You'll like the team we got. Everyone's strong, and we need to be with what's beyond those walls. I hope Earl's right about you. We've all been trying to figure out how to crush Eden's gate. If you ask me, it starts with faith. At least that's what she's calling herself these days. You seen that giant statue on the hill? Of course you have. You can't miss it. Good old Joseph Seed, the father. Faith had her groupies build that concrete eyesore for her sick pilgrimage. You seen them? Those sad fuckers marching their way to that statue? It's horrible. We gotta tear down that statue. Let all those Peggies know their father ain't no fucking god. He's just a <coughs> What do you say, Rook? Go drive a big fuck you size hole into that thing. I think in many instances where something like this has actually happened, I don't know anyone that actually got through it that could take it. At least not at first, anyway. One day I'll be brave enough to tell it, it, I mean, eventually you might get around it, but it's... You never, I don't think you ever truly get over it. I think about all the bad things I've seen and the truth is I, I've never really gotten over them. They're still there. You just learn how to deal with it a little bit better, but it's always going to be there. That's what I've noticed anyway. Some people are just very stubborn. Oh, the bliss is everywhere! The chosen are coming! In a few these hours. People are using those trucks and boats to ship it all over Hope County. You'd be doing a lot of good if you destroy any more you find. I say if these folks are making something that kills people, well, they deserve whatever killing comes to their door. I don't normally do this. I mean I'm going to take some more painkillers. I am allowed to because I'm allowed four doses a day, and we should have three. Yeah. We got word there's an armed patrol cruising the river, and it sounds like she's called in the chosen. The toughest the cult has to offer. Be careful out there. The mist's rising. Gonna make you lose the I'm in quite a bit of pain, so. Well, I think I'm allowed. You wind up like the marshal. White horse out. Marshal. One day I'll be brave enough to tell Charles how I really feel about him. <clears throat> Charles? Who's Charles? You love Charles? Tell me who Charles is and I'll I'll tell him for you. Yeah. I'm sure he loves you too. I can hook you up. Charles! <laughs> Alright, what's your name? I don't know what your name is. Let's go. What am I doing? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Alright. Uh, not so friendly neighborhood angel captured me and threw me in front of the prison. I was over at the Drubman Marina. Let's have a look. <coughs> what can we get? Blum, 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 blum. <coughs> challenges. I actually forgot that I've got challenges to do. Uh, <coughs> Bloody hell. I'm only halfway through the assault rifle kills. I thought I had more than that. Molotovs, 
throwing knives, remote explosives, that should be easy. Hit and run, long range, oh yeah that one, that one's always fun. Saboteur, standard takedowns, death from above, death from below, chain, pistol. What? Oh, of course. Don't mind me, I'm just being dumb. Uh, deer. Oh, I got a deer. I did. Before I activated. Elks, skunks, cougars, bears. Plenty of fish I can get, I suppose. I should really be out there helping people. get a vehicle. The people I kill, the more annoyed I get. Moving, get my back. I mean, why not? That was too close.
Down here. <clears throat> More Jimson weed. Play dead with me. I know you can revive yourself. I owe you big time. <laughs> <clears throat> Whoops. I can't believe what's that. Is real bison. So it is. Smart thinking. Settle down now. Son. Split. An angel split. Knock. Anybody home? Fuck off.
over here. Good, doesn't it? What is that? Is that a wolf? Something is chasing me. <coughs> and it's not me. <laughs> no, ma'am. It's a wolf. I'm not there to get those bodies because I mean, like, that wolf just like took out three. Oh, great, and then they disappeared. Of course, they did! Yay! Ha! Got one! Wait! Ha! I got another one! Got you too, bitch. And you. Uh oh, listen, fuse bullshit. Fishing for Peggy's. <laughs> oh, great, now there's a bell. Could be worse. Could be a lot of things. Could be Christian Bale <coughs> running butt naked down the corridor with a fucking chainsaw and tennis shoes on. You know, something like that. Ah. It's not. It's just a great big bear in the great outdoors. Something you want to say, huh? Talk to the bullet. Go. 
God, that was tense. Yeah, not the face, not the face. <clears throat> You're scaring all my fish away. I will shoot you. Oh, great, now he's another wolf. do I have? I want to get a full, full stash of them. Oh, I'm full. What? Where? Do you have a guinea pig? Where? I'm not eager to pick a fight with a pissed off animal. It doesn't look pissed off to me. At least not yet. So, Johnny boy, how did I know about Christian Bale running down a corridor naked of a chainsaw? How did I know about that? How did I know about that? Oh shit, come here! God, I'm standing there. <laughs> that was me that was me basically confessing I've watched the film I watched it but yes I could have seen a clip on YouTube but no I watched the film it appeared on Netflix on my front page I opened up Netflix and it's got American Psycho right there I'm like for fuck's sake so I just went, okay, think. <clears throat> Let's watch it then. I'm still kind of glad I never watched it. But fuck me. I had no, I had no bloody idea that that guy could be so scary when he's playing, when he's playing a fucking killer. I had no idea he could be, be that good, Mr. Christian Bale. It's not the impression of him I've had in my mind all these years. Honest to God, some a some actors are so damn good, and you don't realize how good they are until they play a different role. And I'll talk about another another actor that I, th that I think is actually very good in a minute. Nice one, shooter! Got you, bitch.
<laughs> firm agreement there. That was that was one very messed up movie. But yeah, excellent acting. Come on, up you get. Alright, drive. Yeah, good man. Hey! Some goddamn faith. The fuck? That bison just appeared inside my car. I mean, really? Yeah, I, I didn't even know Jared Leto was in that film. I was surprised, <laughs> I don't think I've seen him that young yet, but yeah man, he got, I, I was afraid when I was watching that bit, because I knew he was going to kill him, I knew, and I'm like, it's the way he was dancing around and everything, I thought, fucking hell man, this guy's crazy, <laughs> but see, that's what I mean, it's, it's scary stuff, the only reason I, I decided to watch it is really because I was able to play Resident Evil, so it's perked me up a little bit, I guess, I still think Christian Bale is fucking terrifying, man. Oh, hold on a minute. Um, one minute. I just want to look. I just want to look up um, something. Hold on. Yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, solid, solid stuff, man. Solid stuff. My mum was laughing at me because I said to her, I've, I've, I watched American Psycho and she just started giggling. And I said, I didn't know Christian Bale could be freaking scary. And she went, Yeah, he's really creepy, isn't he? Like, when he's, I was like, Yeah, because <laughs> he's, he's, I've seen him in lots of films where he was the good guy. I've seen him, he's, he's been John Connor. He's been, um, uh, he's the lead actor in uh, Reign of Fire, that dragon film. I liked that film. Uh, Batman, of course. Batman. Oh, fuck me! Look at him in this film, man. I mean, Jesus Christ. Greetings. We'll celebrate the glory of the Father. I still like me this little we'll machine gun, man. It's a nice little weapon. Oh, the bliss. There are many who struggle. We see it every day. They are scared. They don't understand. They will not seek our help. Get up Oh, 
Wow. You see how quickly I reacted and threw the knife at that guy? Oh my goodness. Wow. That was quick. Even for me, that was quick. Christ. That was like something out of a movie, literally. They just throw a knife at the bad guy at the last possible second. Mm -hmm. Go and get rid of him. Oh shit, where'd he come from? Hey! No, 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 no. Those guys are not part of the outpost. Dude. That was an angel. Yeah, those two are definitely outsiders because, I mean, I know how many people are in this outpost. Don't fuck around with me. <clears throat> Don't fuck with me, man. I know what I fucking saw, you know? This place is mine. I set it up. Me. That's who... Fucking cockroaches. I eat those cockroaches for breakfast. Where is this coming from? What do you know about the bubble head? Uh oh. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. It, I, it's, oh, that was funny. <clears throat> Voice in like in face talking to me like, where is this coming from? <laughs> uh oh. That's all. That's all I thought about. That's all I thought about. Oh my god, that was funny. SMG11. <laughs> uh, Snip better for them. I didn't like that window, man. You defended this place like I've been blessed again. Really use your help. Oh, trying to better, huh? Shrine. All the way over there, man. Fuck, yeah, sure. <sighs> Alright, let's have a look. Oh, I was gonna say, I know one of these spots has a safe in it. It's almost peaceful here. Almost. Answer is no. I don't team up with random people. And that's not really the purpose of my channel either. 
I'm sure if you just open up an online session, you'll find someone to play with. Do I need a chopper? Or do I need a car? I think I need a car, man. Let's go. Let's go find some shit to shoot. Fucking aiming on my part. Oh, the bliss. Kill him. You're free to go, my friend. Alright, drive. Watch that. My eye, ow. As long as Faith has people trapped, she's got an endless supply of angels. What the fuck's that? Oh, it's a bison. Well, it looks like a bison, but I know it's not. It's a dog! You guys can say, you know, when a guy's got a nice butt or a lady is attractive or something without without ruining anything, you know. It's just technically true. I mean me personally, I actually found it quite found it quite disturbing but funny at the same time to just see him running down the corridor naked with, with his with his trainers on or his tennis shoes or whatever and he's got a fucking chainsaw. I mean I did <laughs> I did kind of laugh, because I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I thought it was... It was different. It was different. You don't, you don't see a lot of chainsaw maniacs just, just naked with a pair of, with like a pair of shoes on, like trainers or fucking tennis shoes or whatever the hell he was wearing. I just thought it was hilarious. <laughs> I felt sorry for the woman, mind you, but yeah, I, I, just, I did think it was funny. You know what? Let's just shoot them. Come on boys, call for backup if you must. Come on, let's get my submachine gun kills going. That's it. Sometimes you just gotta shoot him. We're not sending any help. No, just kidding. We'll be right there. <laughs> What's up, Bubbleheads? You wanna play rough, huh? Oh, fuck! Why are you in a fuel tanker, man? <laughs> why would you... Why would you show up to attack this place in a, in a fuel truck? What the hell? That was actually... <laughs> random, but funny. What the... You just asked him to be killed. 
They scattered all over the Henbane frickin' river. Oh my goodness, that's actually quite funny. In this case, I'm glad I just walked in and started shooting. What the hell? I think, I think I finished the challenge, but let me just double check, because I, I just got lost in the... Yeah, I did. Yeah, <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> oh, God. This game has made me laugh today. It was a copyright claim. Man, this is the most awesome game I've ever played. Ever since I've called it too much damage to this place. What was that? That sounds sensible. How are we gonna get back on the road if our tanks are empty? This game's awesome. You can play with your friends. Damn, I can build my own levels. God damn it. Even Peggy's drained us dry. I need a driver. <clears throat> I need a drink. Those Peggy bastards stole all our gas. They drained these here reservoirs and filled their tankers. So I need you to steal one and bring it back here. Just got word that there's one parked at the old diner down the road. If we're gonna rebuild, we gotta reopen these pumps. We'll keep the truck stop safe. You bring back that sweet, sweet gas. You're talking about the Peggy's brought the gas to us. Just unfortunately ignited. I got high on my own supply, you know. <laughs> All right, drive. Oh, uh oh. Where is this coming from? I don't need this shit in my life. Turn that shit off me. Being handy gives you an edge. You're always needed by someone. Hey, asshole. A hit! A very palpable hit! Smell that? Smell that sweet, sweet gas. The fuck? Hey, Peggy's over there. You're crazy. There's always a Peggy over there. Is that guy smoking? We got them, man. We got them. Good idea. Good have something we need. <clears throat> yeah, Jog Society definitely has done something to me. I, I, I know it sounds really weird, but I feel like it. I feel like it boosted my confidence just a little bit. In the category of horror, you know. You take the wheel. It's a weird. It's, it's just a strange thing because sometimes you'd be surprised what could change your perspective. I mean, heck, I started watching um, Jaws today on Netflix. Jaws to me was always a scary film because you know how I feel about sharks. But when I was watching it, I was okay. 
<clears throat> in fact, when I played Resident Evil the other day offline by myself, you see when I got to our favourite part, I was not even scared. And I mean it, I was not even scared. I'm, I'm, I'm actually used to it now. I was just like, bye, see you later, baby. Literally just went up the, the lift and I had no problems. I was cool. Best game ever. Hi there, miss. Who's there? Wouldn't have helped this place without you, bud. This is fantastic. I was doing, I was doing all right, so, you know, it's, um, it, it, it makes a difference. You know, there's always something that makes a difference. It doesn't matter what it is. If it works, it works, right? That's the way I look at it. Oh, money. Money, money, money. I left all this money in here, man. Come to the game. Here, need a light. Hey, somebody there? Son of a bitch. Shit, you need a light. <laughs> Run! Let's go to the floor! <laughs> Rock, you're hiding under, and I'll drive this truck up your ass. I need to count my lucky stars. I'll call up. I don't need this shit in my life. They're good. <clears throat> I didn't accidentally shoot that resistance member. Of course not. <laughs> Can we leave now? All right, drive. I am driving. Can we go and get that thing over there? Yeah. Have this. for the road. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me today? Oh my god. What's in that house? Let's go and have a look. <clears throat> you see that? See that? Oh, don't run away. I want to pet you. Why are you driving that piece of shit?
For fuck's sake. Don't you for fuck's sake me. I'm for shaken. Ah, oh, I remember this place. There's naff all here, isn't there? What's that for? Who's causing that fire? Oh, look. Just a bad guy. It's just a bad guy. Say good night to the bad guy. There's a bad guy going down. I always tell the truth, even when I lie. There you go. The party's at seven. What's that? You take the wheel. Smart, eh? That looked like fun. Let's do it again. That's all that's left of him is a gun. <laughs> Something you want to say to me, darling? Bite me. <laughs> so glad you came. <laughs> Give me a kiss. Yes, but they were all bad. <clears throat> the collapse is upon us. 
You've been invited into our home, into our heart. Trust in the path and you'll find the answers you seek. Sometimes I feel like I've been wandering the road for years, searching for my father. Even those who fight against us seek salvation. We all need guidance in times like these. So we must be strong. And we must be vigilant. Now you'll see. Now you'll truly understand. Because those on the outside will see what we have built here together in our new Eden. The love. And they will come. And they will try to take from us all that we have built. judge me you judge us the things that you've done people say that I'm crazy but when you wake up in the morning you look at the same news that I do your phone's dead and you're going straight to the tablets stay away from those drugs man this is the world world we built for our children communities being torn apart walls being erected because leaders are too impotent to act bullies are too adult to lead righteously I did not ask for this I was chosen Mankind is weak and vulnerable. And we are hurtling towards our destruction and no one is willing to do anything about it. I can see that. You can see. But we are not crazy. So what are we supposed to do? We just sit back and await the inevitable? claimed to be a perfect man, but I saw what was coming and I chose to act, to lead, because society is broken, and the only way forward is to go back to the way things once were, innocent and pure, so safe and protected in our garden. I can save <clears throat> I still like that scene as well. It kind of um, explains the purpose of this particular story. You won't notice it the first time you play it. Especially if you don't believe what he's talking about. Okay, yeah, I reevaluated that after I finished this one. Huh. <laughs> It's still funny too because, like I said before, my favorite Far Cry villain at the minute is him, Joseph Seed, and it's, it's kind of strange considering in this game your character is mute. But yeah, I love the villain. And he just grew on me, you know. He's a very he's a very interesting character. I mean, it's his, it's his character transition between this Jesus and the next Christ, game that just really, it really blew me away. I was very impressed with it. Hey, Sheriff. 
couple didn't make it back. Boys it just goes to show, if you have a villain in more than one later. game, you can really grow to grow to love them. No, you just you just relax, lie back. I'll see you in the morning. Christ. You come out of the bliss too fast. Shit's liable to scramble your fucking brains. Oh my brains, now you see why I get high in my own supply. There's no fucking brains left. Help! Don't worry, accidental weapons discharge. Don't get your panties in a twist. My assault rifle kills you. Nope, it's the way to way. Back here again. How did that happen? I think I should switch to crystal meth. Alright, okay, so we still have. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, Church, nature cabin. What's that? Council's cabin. I'm not gonna use this clown. Let me just switch to. Let me just go and rescue him. So I can get myself a couple of bits of backup. I want to take out that that fucking statue up there, but I need to think about how I'm gonna do it soon. I may have a goddamn plan. I may not. No problem with that, Mister. What? No. This mist really builds my reflexes. Get your bubble head out of the way!
Kill. You know what? That's actually a pretty good idea. I never, I never even thought about that. And that's good. We can spawn the vehicle here afterwards. There he is. I found you. I'm on the move. Boy, you could have been some kind of ugly. I'm gonna burn that donut cart and blaze off your faces. Hey, man, then come on over. I was about to put on some tunes. Have a BBQ. <laughs> I am Charlemagne Victor Beauchamp. Now, if you require more brevity in your day-to-day -day life, you can just call me Sharky. Welcome to the Disco Inferno, man. It's my special place where I can just be me, without the prying eyes of my PO. I still can't believe that um, law enforcement types such Dylan as Taylor one not actually, actually retweeted one of my my streams on my Twitter account. That was so fire. nice of him. I have pants on no, now, no yes, actor has ever done that before. For me. But it was so kind of him to do it. It's a nice guy. Oh, yeah, it's really me. nice. Cool. Sorry. All right then. Come on. Here is where I am free to. It's time for these brain dead angels to be deader than disco. Take out everyone you see. There's something here that distracted us. Use that as an ammo recharge point. <laughs> Fuck me sideways. Hold this. What the fuck, man? Climb up! Who the fuck? Who's on the gun? Get off that gun! Oh, there's Peggy's here. I'm trying, I'm trying! This is K 
chaos, man. It's funny though. No! Not the pipe bomb! No! Here, hold this. You wanna fuck with me? What the fuck? Man, I wish all cops were cool like you. What can I say, amigo? You and me, we got chemistry. We're like, we're like a freaking team. All right, get back out there, man. Call me next time you're taking on the angels. Oh, I was trying to get my melee kills done. Oh, crazy ash one. believe that <laughs> I forgot that I forgot the Dutch says that it's funny Beggars can't be <clears throat> hey fuck off you little fucking shit from hell don't get out of hell unless I say so what's that what well, you think you're funny do you you think you're smart, eh? Another fucking little shit from hell. Hey, who keeps letting my stuff out? Well, that sucks. Corpses I write every day. Fucking insane, man. Hell yeah! We love to have fun! Uh, hey, Sharky. Uh, hey, Sharky. <laughs> Hell yeah, crank the two. Not that Peggy shit, though. Kill some pinks. Shoot them.
your seatbelt before. Not about to start now. <gasps> Sharky, you lawbreaker. You rebel. You rebel scam. How did I fire two missile barrages? That's weird. I said I accidentally tapped the button and not realized it. Oh. Shoot that fucker. Sharky kills done already. How? He's only been there for like two minutes. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay, Sharky. Okay, whatever you say, Jose. Okay, I heard that. You're not getting away. Say that, that priestess nearly ripped me apart. That, bitch. Fuck. Bitch. Mm. You like that? Yeah, you like that? Have it. Sharky. You could toast her body, that'd be cool. And hot. Hotter than cold. Cow. What? Where? In case you're wondering, I'd love to kill them peggies over yonder. Whoa, a Shit, I'm serious. Fuck. I know they said wild boar, where is it? Bites the flames. Well, look who turned I'm in the boar area. Yeah, of course. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I'm not saying. I mean, I'm not saying I wouldn't like to use Sharky. I just have a problem with all the fucking fire. Fire, fire is not my friend in this. Um, Go for a stroll, cover me. 
these little shits. So where are these where are these pigs? I don't find any. Watch me, I'm moving. One or two. Can hear an oinkin sound. Through. Got you. Fuck you! Well done, Sharky. Oh, these must be pigs, surely. Yep, they're pigs. A good little piggy. There we are. Got some pigs. I have to remember they're right next to this church. Uh, whatever that is, kill it. That's a choice. Me, man. Well, I'll indulge Sharky for a while. Let's, let's, I'll do that. I'll keep him with me. Let's see what we can do. This is, see, I mean, it's one of the reasons I like the way Pastor Jerome is set up in the next one. Because he doesn't have incendiary rounds until he gets like 40 kills or something, you know. And to be fair, I do use them a bit more, you know. As well. Oh. I didn't realize that was anything.
We stashed some things behind the waterfall at Dead Man's Mill. Some of the old machinery got damaged in a fight with the Colt. But if you can fix it, you could stop the water and grapple down to it. It's like only over there, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, I know where these things are, but sometimes I just gotta remind myself in case I forget. Fuck! Is he dead? He was dead. I haven't heard that. <laughs> you gonna cover my ass while I meander? What the hell is with the Wolverines? There's so many of them here. Where are you going? Bitch. Just like my grandma always said, get them in the head and they'd be dead. Oh, your grandmother was very wise. Grandmother's not Nana, is she? Didn't surprise me. <laughs> she actually... <laughs> that would actually make sense. Come to think of it. Did he just throw a smoke grenade? Sharky just threw a smoke grenade. I didn't know he did that. Fuck off. Fuck off. Oh! Oh! Halt! In the name of my law. Fuck off and die. That was weird. Hmm. Get off that thing. Them. <laughs> the coyotes enjoy eating your butt meat. That's funny. Ow, 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 ow,
<laughs> didn't expect that, did you? All you have to do is say when and we'll bust their peggies. Well, there's a peggy there, go and bust him. It's kind of funny, I never really registered that every shotgun person uses smoke grenades. I mean, like, even my allies. Does Pastor Jerome use them? Because I don't seem to remember if he does. Where's that stinky thing? There you go. Got the well wheel. I don't particularly want to get spotted by that right now, thank you. Go for a stroll, cover me. Thank you, I could do with that. Just, just literally just smoking them, that's quite funny.
What the fuck? What was that? Oh, it's a cougar. Okay. Oh, why didn't you just say so? Hell, two cougars? Okay. What the hell is going on? I just heard like five explosions. Oh, what a giant shock. Just in Montana. Hell yeah, crank the tubes. Not that peggy shit. Fuck yeah, man. Get killed. <laughs> Christ the mighty. I think I blew that blockade up. Um, they nearly had us. I mean, if there's a rocket launcher guy blocking that area, yeah, I've been taken out before. Hello. Thank you. Wolverines had died.
Yeah, he's surprisingly quiet. Alright, once I take this outpost, I'm gonna stop the stream. I need to hit to Betty Buys now. Oh, nothing. The hell? Stealth attack to grenade launcher. Classic. Yeah, I never thought I'd see the day where Shark and I were taken out post quietly. <gasps> Not too far away from the chosen. This is where the cult first put down roots in Hope County. Everyone thought they'd make things better here. Couldn't imagine it would come to this. Anyway, keep up the good work, Rook. Done for the day. Not too bad though. Finished uh, Far Cry Primal and started this one off. Not too bad. Yeah man, I'm off to bed too. That was pretty good, I had a, <laughs> had a good laugh.
Yeah, well, I'll be back tomorrow at some point. Uh... This or whatever I feel like playing. Still got Red Dead and God of War to finish off. It's a while back since I played that. Blame Resident Evil. It overpowered me. Bastards. Alright. Johnny Boy, everyone. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out.